as the sun starts to set here on the Palangi Lake, which is really gorgeous. There's a heron over there, and if you can look on the water, all the fish are jumping, and above us there's a beautiful rainbow. And the bird that's flying across there is the treasured Philippines eagle, which has just flown across this part here. But look how beautiful this place is with all these beautiful fish on the water. All the fish are jumping to eat those flies which will go close to the water. And there's the reflection of the rainbow in the sky. We have a storm brewing. I don't know if you can notice, but here there's rain coming. And it always comes every day. You can see the build-up of clouds here on the left. There. And tomorrow we're going to go in the top of a volcano. The volcano is about three kilometers this way. And the views from there will be amazing. You can see the storm clouds starting to form here and here in this place. We've been here all day. The entrance fee is 80 pesos, which is one pound and 10 pence. And then you'll swim all day in those many millions of different pools. And look here, there's a person about to launch their boat into the river to catch the fish. I'll try to make that stable. I'm zoomed in quite far. And there they go, into the lake to catch fish, because at this time of the day they don't cast a shadow. And he has a net, and he's gonna throw that net. But there's so many fish here, it's unbelievable. And I don't know if you can notice there's some smoke in the, in the background there, but that's a, a power station. So they burn cassava and all kinds of things which just grow around, and the things that you don't need, they will burn that. But you can see here, the mountains are so beautiful. This is a paradise like you've never experienced in your life. And tomorrow when we go in the, in the very high volcano, just by walking, you will notice the landscape is like um, a tropical version of Yorkshire, to be honest. Can you see the carabao there? The water buffalo on the other side of the river? with the man, he's moving it. That carabao was in this uh, green foliage most of the day, just relaxing in the water. And also the other one, which is over there, on the other side. And look at all them fish jumping. Look at them. They touch the top of the water and form those rings. And there's a heron just there, waiting to eat something. The water from the resort is not chlorinated. It's the river, it's the mountain water from the volcanoes behind me. You can't see them because there's a big forest here. I'll zoom out. But you can't see them because the, the volcanoes are on there. There's about 14 of them. And there's a big storm cloud. It's beautiful. So, um, the water runs down from the volcanoes and eventually it comes here to irrigate the rice fields which are here. And then it goes through every one of the pools and ends up in here, down here, coming out under there somewhere and flows into this lake. And the lake's really quite big. It'll take you about 30 minutes to drive around it. As far as that smoke is right very far in the distance is the, probably the end of this lake. There's also a power station on the other side of this lake. But um, we've got about another hour here, unless it starts to rain. Then we're gonna get picked up by one of the 
children's family members because there's a child here which is not mine and it's Teresa's cousin's son or auntie's um, granddaughter so, not son, granddaughter um, yep. and here they are so I'm going to hopefully I don't run out of memory but I'm going to take you on a little walk and we'll go to Teresa and there's the boys playing they've been in that pool the whole day they love it I'll show you another pool as well there they are ouch stood on a rock I have nothing on my feet and look at the mosquito bites I have in my legs here that's the, from the mosquitoes but it's my fault because I don't wear anything on my feet at home and in the early morning the mosquitoes will get out of the banana plantation and come and try to find me yes uh, Darren James Bell and the uh, mosquitoes will at this time of day start to come out again to bite people on their legs some of the mosquitoes that killed were full of my blood but those mosquitoes don't carry any dengue fever or anything like that because they're the large banana plantation mosquitoes the mosquitoes that sit and live on water that's um, dirty like the sewerage waters that's where you get the dengue fever from those mosquitoes they're a different mosquito they're actually smaller a lot smaller but here's the one of the other pools and it's getting filled up for tomorrow and there's more pools here and up there and another all the way up this hill here and Teresa is over there in one of those so we'll just go to find her but it's it's a paradise this is a paradise trust me and Christopher if you don't watch this whole video and learn that you need to be here and I'm gonna smack your bum because this is beautiful it's time for you to slow down me old China a little bit and enjoy and come here and let me sort you out with some nice ladies as many as you want like I said I'm getting chased my gosh I'm in demand I've got another two today I want me to go I'm like fucking I can't I promised Teresa I'm going to be with her I'm supposed to be meeting one this afternoon but it's not going to happen anymore Nai video, BDO, Banco de Oro, video. Lamad dong. I want to show you a tiger. These tigers. No, lion. That's a lion, that's a tiger, but it's got. Nai itlog. It's got some eggs hanging. Say more. Ka onka. Sagging. The boy is wet. Hey Dong, Musta, Busoku, Para Dako Akong Tian, Dong Asamanka, Hui. Oh, there's a cat. There's all these type of accommodations, Chris. And we can get you a, a nice lady in there. They'll take care of you. There's restaurants here. Teresa's in there. She's been sleeping. Tradition is, and I'll show you, you hire one of these huts. There's lots. There's, they're dotted all around the place. Every pool's got them. And you pay 500 pesos for the day, which is about eight pounds. And then you will bring your food here. 
and you will eat them on this table. Right, Sean? Right, let's go look somewhere here. So they have a lot of traditional things like the depiction of this white carabao with a trailer on it and then they have like the children's pool and they have like elephants and giraffes and things like that so that children will feel happy they have dinosaurs that's toilets over there there's a restaurant down there there's dinosaurs here and hey guapo hey dong musta keka magunsaka ligo ka ah nai forana kabalo magbisaya nai daghan bakit three frogs then you'll see a crocodile and a, a snake fighting that one and then some daffy duck stuff some giraffes and whatever but the other pools are up there where those guys are up there There's some more places to sit here in these cabins there's cabins all around this pool here also and it's very relaxing today is wednesday so it's a little bit quiet here but i saw 60 people get out of the back of a truck and they came here for their um they're swimming today and they're splashing around today so let's go for a walk my feet are hurting because i should have put on my shoes that guy is delivering the containers for people to put their trash hi sean we're going for a walk you want to come Daddy, yes mama said we were gonna go. Whoosh! We'll look up there. Yeah, and because Mama said we saw a lot of fishies. In here? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. But first, oh. but first we will. Where's the fishies? They're at the top. Show me. They're at the pile. Near that guy. Are we going? Not now. Me and you. You first. You are the tour guide. Yep. Tour guide car. So it's really nice, these gardens. They really maintain them well. The two guys who were talking to me, they were cleaning the area. And it's really lovely. Danica, we're going for walking. Lavka. Let's go up there in the Gamai Bukid. No, Correct. It's disgusting. Yeah, it's Bawal. Where's that? Is the. Is it? We're looking for some fish. In this forest. Uh, con. Uh, fur cones, Sean, that's what they're called, fur cones, because these are the deciduous trees called pines, pine trees. Oh, sakit akong eel. There's a path there, let's go to that. Nai, nai guapa. Nai guapa, no? Yes. Once a month. That's a. That's not Isda. It's just a bench. A what? Mama said. No, say it properly. Mama said. Yep. Because. Fishes. Where? I don't know. I can't see any fishes. Oh, I think the fishes are in there. Yes, I see them. 
Yes. Yes, oh. Let's go this way. Well, I coach in Ilas. Pobre Ako. Nara, oh, that hand is the. Over there. In that pool. I see them. There is a bird. Ouchie. Let's look here. There's a fish pond. Look how beautiful this place is. Wow. That looks like a fish pond. Let's go this way then. In here. Let's jump to there. Go. Wait. Golf carts, they're not running anymore. Maybe the, the battery's gone. The battery's gone gooba. It's gone gooba broken. Pobre ako dai wala cochinilas. Feeling pobre ako. Dili. Come on. Hey, guapa. Good guapa, no? Akong, Akong son, Sean. Guapa, no? Night Banco, video, 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 video. Hi, hi. My click, Kaika. My blog, Sha. My dog hunt is the Gagmai. My dog hand is the... Wow, look at this view. Come on, everyone. Come on, this is beautiful. Wow. Come on. You can't beat this. It's unbeatable. This is unbeatable. I'll show you the depictions of the tribal people from the Bukid, from the mountain. The, the people live, actually, in these mountains. These types of people. Wow. Grabiang is the no Naiputi. There's a white fish there. Then we will go here. This is the people who live in the mountains, this type of peoples. You want to see the is the Isa puti ang is the dito no? Wee! Wow, wow! The color orange. Wow, grab you know. They're coming! I don't know if you can see these, but it's lots of fish coming. Just put your foot there in the water. Give them a nova. They will cut on that. Crunch it like this. Crunch it. They will cut on that. There, they will cut on the nova. Look at that one there, the orange one. Yeah, that one. Oh, it's lots of them. Nice, no? Go on, crunch them, your nova. Just one time. Go on, crunch, crunch, crunch. Go. Go on then. That's a lot of fishes. There. Let's go this way. We're gonna go now. There's millions of fish. 
They can cut on them, but they don't really like them because it's halang. Let's don't slip here because it's very slippy. Right. Let's go in the I mean look how beautiful this is. Look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? Right, let's go. We have no chinny lass. Right, let's go in this way and we will see a nice... What can you see, Sean? Is it a waterfall? Yeah, there's a waterfall in there. You can see it coming down through there into here. It's feeding the, the Palangi Lake. Right. Let's go for a walk here. I'll get on this grass, even though this grass is sharp. Sharp, no? Mm. Ooh. My foot is sack it. Hurt on here. Then ouch. That's a sack it one, oi. Oh a rocking chair. Nice, no? So this is RR Spring Resort, Christopher, or anybody who's watching. I love RR. It's in Maramag. Maramag. M-A-R. A-M. Maramag. A-G. There. Is that gorgeous? And the temperature right now is about 30 degrees as well. Nice, no? Sean is eating the the chips and he's also playing on the swing. There's two cars there, but they're not yours. I think they belong to those children there. Christmas tree, yes. And we've been on a round trip, so we're coming back to the original uh, swimming pool. Sean's already running there. He can see his brothers, the two brothers, Big Darren and Small Simon. Welcome to paradise. This is just one place. Most places are as beautiful as this. Some places are more beautiful. But I mean, it's only, you know, £1.10 to get in. You just spend the time here all day. You can actually hire this place at night time and swim all night and sleep here also. Uh, you just make your own bed anywhere you like. Filipinos can sleep on floors, they can sleep on benches and then they'll have breakfast in the morning then they'll go home after their shower. Hi Simon. Hi. Simon's there. Hello. Oh, Daghan is the... I'll show you in the video. That's baby Darren's silly face. Do, how about this? How about this face? Go on then. Get there. Don't touch his ghoul eye. He touched his ghoul eye. Darren, Simon, Sean. Finished? Okay. Have you got everything you need? Did you see the Isda? Sean, you want to show him where is the Isda? There is Daghan. Feed them one. Feed them the crispy one, okay? Yeah, because it's spiky. Don't don't slip on those tiles. It's very slippy. Next to the Isdas. The fish. Isda fish. 
So the joke is, is that you? Is da you? Is that you? You are a fish. Okay, so here we go. And this small pool is now closed. And the boys have come out. They've been there all day. Magblogko, oh. YouTube. Hey, guapo? guapo. Yes or no? Yes. Pagsuro. <laughs> guapo, ikaw. <laughs> oh, pagsuro ba? <laughs> ikaw dong. Guapo ka? <laughs> Obvious man. Oi, naro. <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you this Philippines people are happy. They have the basic job. Cucinero ako dong. Dili social ako cucinero. Oh, para dako kong tian. So I will send this video to my friend in the UK. And now you are famous in YouTube. Unsay oras gawas sa imong trabaho dong? Oh, it's nearly there. Yeah, just. Maybe a half hour, something like that. Nice, no? Yes. Lama dongs. Very nice. Very nice. Right, and we'll just make our way back to the place of where we started. And then we will have a very nice video. Let's see if Teresa is still sleeping. Darling, go. I made a full tour video. Darling, go. Hui. It's for my cotton. Yes. I say, I'm going to a toy. I will go down here. Then turn right. The the play pool there is now closed. Yeah. Yep. Yes. The, the boys have gone on a tour to see that is the we already went there. This is our finished food. Chicken manok, chicken manok, spaghetti and sag, uh, sagging pritu and rice and our drinks. There. Oh. Right, we end this video. And hope that you can come here one day in the RR Spring Resort. Grabby. <laughs>